John Campbell has been fishing for most of his life, and he says the Brown Trout Festival offers a very special experience. And there's a lot of competition to get the big fish, and it just drives us fishermen crazy to, to know that you can catch a good fish for money, you know? It's kind of the drive I get. It's just a lot of fun. Spend a week out on the water, you know, and it, it's hard on you, but you learn to love it. To prepare for this year's tournament, John and his son Josh let me tag along for an evening fishing session on Lake Huron. We left from Presque Isle Harbor and the first task was to figure out where to set up shop. I like to fish north. Cold water in shallow, that's where that's where you always get some better fish. But when it's warm, they're not in there, so you gotta go out in the deep to find them. Last year, John caught the largest salmon of the Brown Chat tournament on the first day of the event. So what's the key to reeling in the money fish? The secrets are just uh, keep fishing. That's the thing is you just stay out fishing. The more time you got your lines in the water, the better chance you got of getting the fish. And if you get certain lures that work, then you're good. If you, you can't find them to work, keep changing them until you do, and then, then you know, something will happen. Spending so much time on the water, things can get a little dull when the fish aren't biting. It can get pretty annoying, but it's just fun to be out here either way. If you don't catch them or you do. It's nice when you do. After about two hours, John and Josh still hadn't seen any action, but I learned to stay vigilant on the boat because you never know when it will be time to reel one in. Oh, there's a fish. Fish on. Yep, it's a good one. Basically, don't let any slack in the line. So you gotta reel down to the fish and come up on them. Nice fish. You there? Yep. Oh. Nice oh. fish. The Campbells caught one lake trout and two king salmon. <laughs> Not a bad night on the lake. Bigger. The whole event gets bigger. And louder too. 